Yo, what's up, guys? This is Hunter the Red Jacket. I am here today to bring you guys a playthrough of the new Pokemon Mystery Dungeon DX video game, which is actually just a remake of the old Mystery Dungeon Red and Blue Rescue Teams. So let's go ahead and get into this and see how this game plays because I am definitely interested in this one. This game automatically saves your progress. Okay, that's actually good. Good. Oh, music, absolutely phenomenal. I love this soundtrack. Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Rescue Team DX. I have to play on my announcers of voice. Need to actually practice that shit. <laughs> I fucking, I just fucking love this. It's so good. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and get into this new game. I wonder if they're gonna do it like. Oh, uh, yep. Welcome. This is the portal that leads to the world of Pokemon. But before I can let you through. I have several questions for you. I want you to answer them sincerely. Are you ready? Okay. Let the interview begin. Now this interview is actually allowing us to basically answer some questions and based on these questions, it'll, the game will actually pick which actual Pokemon that they want you to be. Now let's actually see what this game thinks that I am as a Pokemon. This will be interesting. Because I don't remember these questions at all, even though I played this game. Do others often call you childish? Surprisingly, no, actually. You come across as. Wait, you come across a treasure chest. How do you react? Open it right away. Nope, could be a track. It's going to be empty. I come across a treasure chest, and the last time I came across. A treasure chest that motherfucker was a trap cuz I was playing Dark Souls nope could be a trap there is a scream from behind a door how would you react yank the damn door open I ain't screaming do you hate to be the last person to leave class at the end of the day it was a school day no You broke a rotten egg in your room. What will you do? Open a window right away. Cause, oops. Can you sincerely thank someone when you feel grateful? Yes. Do you get the feeling that you've slowed down lately? The I think so. Should I go a yes on this one? So let me see. Actually, I was never. Nah. Should I say no or should I say yes? Let's go with no. Probably not. Can you go into a haunted house? With someone I like? Uh, n no. No problem. No problem. Okay. Do you want to play as a boy or a girl? A boy, obviously. You appear to be the brave type. You have a strong sense of justice. You hate evil. You will take on any opponent, okay? You are truly a hero. Go forth for justice, for peace of on earth. Fight the forces of evil. If I'm wrong, work at becoming a true hero. A brave person like you should be. Oh, <laughs> what? Uh, that's not just any freaking mantra. That's a shiny mantra. What the hell? <laughs> Okay. You appear to be 
No, this isn't right. That's that's a nice gesture and all, but I don't feel like a Monchamp like at all. So I'm gonna say no, that isn't right. Which Pokemon would you like to be? Oh, this is interesting. Eevee. There's Charmander, there's Bulbasaur, there's Torchic, there's Cubone. My parents ain't dead. <laughs> no. Uh, there's freaking Trico. I love Trico. Trico was always the Pokemon that I enjoyed getting in that region. Eevee, Bulbasaur. If I become an Eevee, basically. Ah, uh, let's see. And there's a Mudkip. If I become an Eevee, I can basically be a Fox. If I become Cyndaquil, I'm basically a Fire thing. Hold on a second. Eevee a normal type. Oh wait, I think they're- are they all sparkly shinies? Or is that just a games thing? Cause they got a lot of texture on these characters. Pikachu... Trigo! There's freaking Meowth, there's Skitty. My boy Bulbasaur in the house. Oh wait, he's a grass poison? <coughs> Didn't know that one. No way, they have mega evolutions in this game. So because of the fact that they have mega evolution, I'm definitely gonna go with Trico. Cause I like Trico's mega evolution. It basically a grass, if I remember a grass dragon? I believe, yeah, so let's go with this. We're going with Trico. The final step, who would you like to have as a partner? Choose the Pokemon you want as your partner on this journey. Yeah, your partner will be... Cubone. Cubone becomes Marowak. I have Charmander, Squirtle, or Pikachu. Wait a minute, why do they have Totatile but they don't have... Tree... Chikorita, I don't know. This freaking Psyduck. Your partner should be a girl. I'd like to give her a nickname, Ava, right? Because Ava sounds just like the proper name for her, Ava. I'm probably going to turn her into an Espeon. Uh, okay. Let's go. Let's get you into the world of Pokemon. Go for it. I don't even think this is going to actually be my team when we play this game. It's just the one I'm choosing so far. Just to get like a feel of the game. Where am I? Am I dreaming this? I feel a pleasant breeze. I hear a voice from out somewhere. I wonder who it is, who it is. Excuse me, please wake up. Come on, wake up. You're finally awake, great. Those textures look funny as hell. Ugh.
Ha. Huh. Where, where is this? You were passed out here. I'm glad to see you are awake. I mean, you are awake. I'm Ava. Happy to meet you. And you are... i never seen you around here before. Huh? You say you're a human? But you look like... A Trico. A normal Trico in every way. Eh? What the hell? It, it's true. I have turned into a Trico. But why? I don't remember anything. Um... You're kind of weird. Your name. What's your name? My name? That's right. My name is... Dante. A couple of my favorite characters with this name. Dante from Dante's Inferno. Dante, the main character for the original Devil May Cry. All the way up until, I believe, 3 and then 4. It's the other one. And then, uh, Dante as in the Count of Monte Cristo. Well, Dante's, but... Same... Same difference. Dante. Oh, Dante's your name? Well... Isn't it a funny name? Uh, no. Somebody, please help me. Huh? I hear shouts from over there. It's a Butterfree. What's wrong? It's horrible. My Caterpie fell into a cavern. My poor baby. What? A huge fissure opened in the ground and my Caterpie fell in. He's too young to crawl out by himself. When I went to get my baby, Pokemon suddenly attacked me. Huh? You were attacked? By other Pokemon? They must be enraged by the fish and are out of control. That's what I think. I'm not strong enough to fend off those wild Pokemon. What will become of my baby? Oh, what am I... Wait, what am I to do? Oh dear, oh dear. This sounds bad. We have to go help. Treewood. Okay, they have the old soundtrack. I enjoy that. Oh, this soundtrack is so good. Could this be a mystery dungeon? It is. It's a mystery dungeon. A mystery dungeon is truly a mysterious place. The layout and the item change every time you enter. You could proceed by using the stairs, but you'll have to find uh, the stairs first. And you remember the that Butterfree said Pokemon in the dungeon attack, right? If necessary, we have to fight. Let's do our best, Dante. So let's actually go. So Dragon's Breath Absorb, huh? Okay, that's our map. Move setting. Iron Tail! What the hell? Quick Attack! Quick Attack! It'd have been funny if they actually did real life Pokemon battles. So, Iron Tail is my default. Oh wait, nope. Quick Attack. Dragon Breath. No, it would have been interesting if they went into actual Pokemon battles every time you rent a encounter with someone. Move, you psycho! You're up in the way. And here we found the stairs. Uh, you yellow team make green, items blue, enemy Pokemon red, stairs white, okay. Okay, you can move now, jackass. Do not, do not get in front of me. 
Oh, I didn't even... Uh, let's look around, since I can actually just make this thing go... Oh, auto mode. So that's what that is, auto mode. Auto mode, basically, it sends me to areas. And I ain't really gotta do anything but allow this thing to just walk by itself. Clear. Oh, and this thing going down where it says, like, 70, that's basically what I'm dealing with. I'm basically, the longer I stay in dungeons, the hungrier I get. And so that thing right there goes down. So uh, right now I'm at 69 because of this thing. Iron Tail. I miss. I don't know. Yeah, let the game just do the auto thing. Oh, I, wait, it just found the stairs. Alright, I guess there was nothing else there, so they just found the stairs. Wow, Mommy, where are you, Sniff? Well, we came to rescue you. Huh? Your mom's waiting. Let's get you out of... Okay. Dante successfully completed the rescue at Tiny Woods. My baby's safe. I'm sorry, I don't know how I could ever thank you properly. Oh, it's okay. I mean, oh, that's okay. It has been dangerous lately with sudden quakes and fissures like that one. It was great to find your little boy unharmed. Please, may I have your names at least? I'm Ava. And this is Dante. Uh, you don't have to talk for me, girl. Cool. He's, uh, staring at me adoringly. Those sparkling eyes. It's a little embarrassing. But this doesn't feel bad either. It's like I'm a hero. Helping Pokemon in trouble might be a good experience. Thank you, D Ava Dante. I know it isn't really enough, but this is a token of our thanks. Please accept it. You got tiny reviver seeds. You got... A picture berry and 500 yen. Thank you so much. Uh, it's goodbye with Poke Dollars, not Pokemon, not Poke Yen. Thank you for helping. You're very tough. I was sure I'm impressed. So, what are you going to do? Do you have any plans? No? Listen, Dante. If you don't have a place to stay, you should come with me. Okay, we're just gonna follow him. Her. Well, this is the place. Wow. I can't explain, but I'm happy. I'm a human being, but I like this place. I feel... Oh, weirdly happy. It might be an instinct thing for Pokemon. Maybe this is what it feels like to want to wag your tail. It doesn't matter, I'm happy. Maybe I feel that way because I'm a Trico. Oh, Dante, you're impressed, aren't you? I thought so. I thought this would make a good place for you to live, Dante. I was sure you would like it. This is your mailbox. They deliver mail from other Pokemon here. Many Pokemon are suffering from these natural disasters. Just like that Fisher, the Fisher Caterpie fell into. There have been all sorts of natural disasters recently. I want to do good. I want to help Pokemon like that. I want to help make the world a safer place for Pokemon. So, um... Well, I saw how good you were when we rescued Caterpie. Would you like to form a rescue team with me? I think we could be the world's number one rescue team, Dante. What do you think? Oh, why not? Okay, good done deal. From now on, Dante, we're partners in our rescue team. I'm so glad. The, the name, the team's name is, I haven't decided on one. Listen, Dante, what would be a good name for us? The Spec Specs. The Spec Specs. Uh, 
How about just DGX? DX, of course. Is DX okay? DX! Degenerate Execution. I like it. It's a good name. It's perfect. Oh. Oh, and one more thing. I wanted to wear this on the day I started on the rescue team. I have two of them, so let's put them on. Dante puts on a scarf he got from Ava. Looks good. You wear it well, Dante. Don't you feel focused like we're on the same team together? Uh, rescue Team DX. Let's do good, starting tomorrow. And that's how, that is how Dante and Ava began their careers together as a rescue team. Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Rescue Team DX. Well, is that it? Is that it for that demo? Huh. The next morning, I guess it isn't. I'm still the same. The way I look, I'm still a Trico. But why would I be transformed into a Pokemon? Hmm. I don't understand this at all. Oh, that's right. That Pokemon. I think it was Ava. We made a promise to form a rescue team together. I wonder what Ava is doing. I should go out. So basically, I'm just going to go out and explore. The graphics on this is phenomenal. I like the bright colors. A little, a little a bit too bright, but it's perfectly fine. I can get used to it. Why is Ava sleeping there? Huh? Oh no! Ah ha ha! Sorry! I was so excited about today. I've been waiting here since dawn. I must have fallen asleep. Anyway, today marks the start of our rescue team. Let's always do our best. But, um, we don't have any job offers yet. Ha 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 ha. Oh, yeah. Maybe there's something in the mailbox. Ava checks the mailbox. The mailbox contains a rescue team starter set. I knew it'd be there. It's the rescue team starter set. They always give you one if you start a rescue team. Ava opened the rescue team starter set. There was a rescue team badge inside. There was a toolbox inside too. There was also an issue of Pokemon news inside. Yes! There are some good things here. First off, the rescue team the wait, the rescue team badge. It shows that we are a rescue team. This is a toolbox. Use it to carry items you find in dungeons. Let's put the stuff Butterfree gave us in here for now. Items are very useful, so let's use them on our adventures. And finally, a copy of the Pokemon News. It's useful for rescue teams. I'll put the Pokemon News in the mailbox. You should read it later on. Anything else? Is there any other mail? Maybe not. Ava checked the mailbox. But the mailbox was empty. Okay, so there isn't any mail for us after all. If there were any rescue jobs, we would be getting mail, but... Nobody knows about us since we're such a new team, I guess. Ha ha ha. I wonder what it could be. The Pelibur. That is fucking. Maybe it's a rescue job offer. What does it say? 
Dante, read the letter. Buzz, buzz, buzz. I heard about you from the canopy. Please, we need your help. Magnemite is in trouble. A strange electromagnetic wave flowed through a dungeon, and it stuck Magnemite and Magnemite together. This isn't enough to form a magneton. It's not complete the way it is now. Please, we need help. Buzz, buzz, buzz. Magnemite's friend. What do you think, Ink? Do you think we should go? That's the spirit. Let's do our best. Yeah. Fuck it. <laughs> Fuck. Thunderwave K. Oh, you are here, but uh, my friends are in this cavern. My friends should be on B at B6F. Please help them. Okay. B basically the dash. But screw dashing, just a lot of game to actually just go. Iron Tail. How'd you miss? I don't understand how Iron Tail can miss when he's like right there in front of me. Uh, let's look around. Uh, there are two enemies here. And there, I am grateful that you can feed her. I think it was a lot easier to feed her in this than it was in the original game. Would I like to go? Yes, I would. Thank you very much. If you're in the dungeon and fail in your adventures, you lose all the items and money you're carrying, which is BS, but hey, that's how it is, right? Oh, and it, actually, this is a teleporter, if I remember correctly. Oh, no, it's not. This is a trap. Or something close to a trap. You gotta watch out for those things on the ground, because sometimes they can be traps, and other times they can actually help you out. Okay. Up, oh, we leveled up. 
Pico level 6, health 44, okay. Now we're going to BF, uh, the B5F, BF5. <laughs> And we finally made it to the last one. Like, ah, the pain! No, I can't escape! We're stuck together. Oh, there they are. Let's get them out of safely. Successfully completed the job at Thunder Cave. The Thunder Wave Cave. Our bodies separated. Yay! Yay. Be careful. Be thankful, you two. You are our heroes, thank you. Got the big apple. And that big apple is to help us with our stuff, shit. We have to eat those apples while we're in a cave so we can go longer. I'm so glad our rescue mission went so well today. I need to confess, since that was our first job as a rescue team, I was really, really nervous. I can't believe how tired I am. I'm going to go home and get some sleep. Let's do, let's do good again tomorrow. See you. Oh, and this is where you basically we start having dreams of a Pokemon calling out to us. Where, where am I? Maybe, is this a dream? Oh? There's someone here. Who is it? Someone I know? Hmm. I can't remember. I was vague as hell. I think I dreamt something. But I can't quite remember what that dream was about. Oh well, today is another day of rescues. I can't really exp- I mean, I, well, I can- I can't really tell anybody because it would be spoilers, but yeah, it's def it definitely was somebody who was calling out to you. I'm not gonna tell you who it was though, because I've actually beat this game before. Checks the mailbox, but there's no mail seeking help for a rescue team. Good morning, Dante. Aren't you up early? Oh, you checked the mailbox. So, was there anything? Were there any rescue requests? Nope. Huh? There's nothing? Hmm, I guess that makes sense. After all, we only just begun. Oh well, we should go to the Pokemon Square. We should check the Pel uh, the Pelipper Post Office. I think they'll have jobs posted. Pokemon Square is over th here. Let's go. Pokemon Square is definitely this way. Basically, the Pokemon Hub Market thing. This is Pokemon Square. Oh, that looks nice. That looks real nice, though. That's the... Um, Kecleon. No, wait. Kecleon shop. You can buy and sell items there. That's Felicity Bank. You can save your money there. That's the Gopin Link Shop. Gopin can link moves for you. Basically, if you want to do double move. Huh? What's linking? Well, if you link moves, you can use them together at the same time. You should just ask Gopin for details. This is... Kangas Kong storage. If you if you store items here, they'll be safe. You should store important items here before you go out to the dungeons. Ooh. And over there is the uh, Makuhita Dojo. At the dojo, you can learn or get training on various maneuvers used in dungeons. What do you think? The businesses here help us. 
Oh, and there's also the Pelipper or post office. That's up past here. I think we can get rescue jobs information there. So, how about we go to Pelipper's post office first? I'll tell you all kinds of things when you're not sure where to go. Ask your partner. The building is the Pelipper Post Office. This building. This is where information is gathered from Pokemon needing rescue. See? Have a look at this bulletin board. It lists rescue jobs. Check it out. Tiny thunder 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 Accept the job uh, You won't come across objectives for jobs you put on in the dungeon, okay? Oh, these are put on hold, okay, never mind See? There, there were jobs listed, right? If you want to do a rescue job, choose the job, then go to the dungeon that's indicated. You can go to the dungeon by taking the path near the base, so from where our base is going down. And that's how. Yep, this way. While we're starting out, we should handle the jobs that are posted here. Doing that should get our team some recognition. That should pull in job offers to our mailbox soon. We're definitely going to do the three jobs first. So we're going to Thunder Wave Cave. Cuz we can get those we can get those done all at the same time. You can head to the dungeon from the that road. Once we receive a job, let's go to the dungeon and solve the Pokemon troubles. There are sparks around a dungeon name that's a sign that you'll get lots of stuff. You can get almost twice the normal amount of money and a lots of treasure boxes. The tiny woods. Oh, I don't think they added that. That's interesting. Well, let's go ahead and go through this because that that makes you actually want to do stuff. So this wasn't actually in the original game. At least I don't believe I um I don't believe it was. But basically they added they added like a lot of stuff there so that every time you meet the dungeon you can always find a whole lot of treasure chests and a whole lot of money so that you can have so that you can um, use all that stuff. So this is that's something interesting since they added that here. Because status sleep was the Pokemon won't get the sleep napping, yawn, or nightmare status conditions. This status wears off when Pokemon move to the next floor, okay? Uh, I think my Pokemon are going crazy right now. Hold on. Because there's a lot of explore, we don't want to take out any Pokemon that might pose a threat. Actually, we want to take out all Pokemon that might pose a threat. Wait, who just leveled up? Oh, Ava did. Good. Now, two level sixes. And we always want to protect the Pokemon, the um, like the third wheel Pokemon, because if you, if your Pokemon, if the Pokemon you're supposed to be helping dies before you complete the mission, then the mission is a failure. So we always have to protect the Pokemon. The message in the bottom right of the screen will tell you what's happening in the dungeon. If you want to check past 
messages go to the log from the uh, from others in the X menu. You arrive at the floor where Saken is. Bring X2 to Saken's location. Oh, I didn't even have to do anything there. He just protected his own friend. Huh. You found Sekurin. Wait, Sunkern. You were looking for. Next, have moved next to Sunkern. Have the Pokemon wait longer, have the Pokemon move elsewhere. It's like a warp to somewhere on this floor. Huh? Is that right? Okay. That's weird. So basically, they want you to do like that round trip thing. Gain okay, magical powers and they leave. At the dungeon. Would you like to exit the dungeon now? No. Because there are items here that I want to get. Because they said that there's a specific amount of new items here. So we want to make sure we get all the items. That we possibly can. Thank you for taking me to Sunkern. This is your reward. So we got a rainbow gummy and iron. The items you receive have been sent to the storage. So we don't get it in our box, it goes straight to the storage. Didn't we do good today? Let's call it a night and get some rest. Okay, see you tomorrow. Good morning, Dante. Let's do our best today. Huh? What's going on? Tunnel over there! Tunnel over there! Tunnels everywhere! Woohoo! Digging is so much fun. Eh? Um... Where am I? Hey, what's going on? Oh my, my apologies. My name is Diglett. I was having a blast digging tunnels in front of the Pelper Post Office. So much so that I kept on digging and ended up here. I'm sorry I ruined your p your nice place. Haha, <laughs> don't worry about it. It's just a hole. Are you saying you will forgive me? Too many holes might annoy others, so don't dig too many. Of course, thank you. Uh, from now on, I'm, I'll have fun digging, but... I'll also make sure to patch up the holes from time to time. Goodbye. Pelbar with my mail. Okay, I did. That's something new as well. A freaking teleport, basically. Check. Welcome to the rescue team. Your badge has the power to send back to town any Pokemon you rescue. Just hold the badge up and it does the rest. By advancing through your adventures, you will be rewarded points that raise your team rankings. Aim for the bronze rank for now. Okay. Talk about team rescue organization. Okay. 
if you have dojo tickets you can train at the makuhito dojo at the makuhito dojo your moves grow more than they do in dungeons especially if you keep on hitting the foe with super effective moves you can expect to grow a lot you can also learn the controls at the dojo for free check out Matsuhito dojo when you want to learn the moves oh so i got two bronze and the superb gift huh oh wait pressing the wrong button a superb gift from the rescue organization to hard workers like you try to drastically power up by using the enclosed go dojo ticket at the monkey the dojo Okay. Why not? Since we have the br the two brown tickets and a gold ticket, let's actually go ahead and use it. This is the Makahita Dojo. Only those rigorous training can become stronger. Pick the trade. Learning moves dash. Dojo drills. Oh, is this your first time trying dojo drills? You'll need to give me a dojo ticket if you want to try dojo drills out. The better the ticket you use, the more effective the drill will be. Choose the ticket you use. Oh, we got two bronze tickets. So Ava will take on the normal maze, huh? Alright, let's do this, the drill. Defeat the enemy within the time limit, you can get a lot of XP when you use super effective moves. Time up. Level up. Okay. That was fine. Go to go ticket and trico. You gotta take on the grass maze, huh? Alright, let's do this. Dojo drill starts now. And the time is over. And I've reached level 10. Nice. That was real good. It's all over. Nice work. Do you want to keep going? No, I'm good. Anything else? No, thank you. 
See you later. Come back as soon. I mean, come back soon if you want to keep getting stronger. Now that we're here, let's see. Oh, Thunder Cave. Luckily, we're going here anyway because there are three different rescue missions that we can complete. Okay, our client is with us. They would be one hit wonders though because what? If you bring a treasure box back with you from a dungeon, it will open. It will contain a mysterious item. Okay, you can take the pretty box and let's go. You've arrived at the floor where. Plusle is. Let me get onto Plusle's side. Where the hell is Plusle? Probably all the way over here. Another pre box. Nice. Job is complete. Thank you very much. Done to help hustle gain magical power. No, I would not. We're gonna continue to go. Another box. Okay. And we're just going to basically go. See how my thing is at level 15 right now. Basically, what you want to do is you want to go to your items, use an apple, eat the apple, and now your thing is back to 100%. Iron tail. Yeah, 
Yay, you found Pidgey. So we rescue Pidgey. Payback. Wild Charge CM. Rainbow Gummy. Rainbow Gummy. Ooh, a bronze ticket. And they're all going to the storage. Thank you for taking me to my beloved Pleso. This is your award. Perfect apple. Definitely need one of those. The items you receive you receive have been sent to the storage. Thank you for rescuing Pidgey. This is your reward. Carbos and Max Ether. Thank you for rescuing me. This is your reward. A blast seed. Didn't we do good today? Let's call it a night and get some rest. Okay, see you tomorrow. About to have another dream, huh? Again? Am I dreaming again? Is that Pokemon again? It's that Pokemon again. Huh? They're talking to me? I can hear them clearly. What are they saying? Huh? It's shaking. 
An earthquake? What? It's getting worse. For a dream, this feels strangely real, but... Because it is real. It ain't no dream. The next morning... Uh, hello? Hello, um, are you Dante? Aren't you? You are Dante, aren't you? Oh, you can't see us, of course. How very rude of us. We're pleased to meet you. We are Doug Drill. Uh oh. Last night during the earthquake, our child Diglett was attacked. What, Diglett? He was whisked away to the peak of a tall mountain. We couldn't possibly climb somewhere so high. That is why we must call upon you for your help, Dante. Diglett was abducted by a Pokemon named Skarmory. It's a vilely vicious ruffian. Please do be careful. Please, we need your help. We must go. That was so sudden and there was no time to even say no. But I am concerned to hear that Diglett has been kidnapped. It's too bad I'd better go. Good morning, Dante. Huh? You were just asked to go on a rescue mission? Yes. Our child Diglett was kidnapped. He was taken to Mount Steel Summit. Please, we need your help. Bye bye. I'm um, okay. Wait, Diglett was the one digging holes here, right? This kidnapping is worrisome. Let's go. That's it for the demo version. You can play further in the full game. You can look around the town freely. Go to the menu and choose other from the X menu and then you can save the code menu. Okay. Let's go to other. Save and go to main menu. Cause that's all we can actually do so that was pretty fun if I do say so myself now when we actually get the the official game I don't think we're going with we're not going with this team we're probably gonna do something a lot different it just depends on what I'm thinking of because we're definitely going to enjoy this well there's friend rescue there's wonder mail and then there's name changes you can change the name wonder mail you can't try this in the demo version you can try it I guess we can't even see what it is. Well, anyways, I hope all of you guys enjoyed this. This has been Hunter Red Dragon. And I'm going to go ahead and sign out. Make sure you guys subscribe. Click that notification bell. We want to be notified when I upload it again. And I will see all of you guys next time. Peace.